you do the work. All right. Welcome, class. Welcome to Creative University's Creators Cafe Lecture Hall. How's everybody doing this morning? Everybody feeling all right? I see a lot of cups of coffee, so that's a positive sign that everybody is trying to stay awake. We're trying to make things happen. That's what we are talking about here today for class. Today we'll, we'll, we will be discussing the theory of create-tolusion. All right, I see laptops, I see pens, I see pads. That's what I like to see. All right, let's get started, shall we, very much. Thank you. Class, let's begin. Please, before we start, all sounds to your phone. Put them on zero or vibrate, please. Thank you. Can we rock and roll? Thank you. Okay. Today we will be discussing the theory of create illusion. Create illusion. Illusion. What is this, Mr. Johnson? What is create illusion? Create illusion is the divine art and the fact of. I can't stand these pens. I tell you, every time a class comes in right before us, they take all the good ones, and I'm stuck with the crappy. Creationism. Evolution. Creationism plus evolution gives us create illusion. This is the theory that has been divinely passed down throughout mankind. A template that has been embedded within the minds and the DNAs of the beautiful philosophers, scientists, thinkers, theorists of our present time and our past time. That, this, is the example we follow. So from here, creationism. What is creationism? Yes. No. Creationism. Let's try to keep this neat for you all. Just taking notes. I know how important notes are to a lot of you. So, let's break this down. We said creation, create illusion is what? Correct. Creationism plus evolution. There you go. One star for you. Let's begin with creationism. Creationism. Life. Earth. And universe. Supernatural being. Creationism. 
life, earth, and universe started from a supernatural being. That means this creative property or energy that is far, far more superior than what we could be creating iPods and laptops and automobiles. Divinely orchestrated and crafted what we have been discovering and learning about called the universe. This is creationism. Anybody, can anybody, tell me the definition of evolution? Anyone? Yes. All right. Well, congratulations. Congratulations. Evolution. generations evolution change in inherited characteristics of biological populations over successive generations we can call this innovation in today's context you started with the old bulky brick cell phones that weighed like 5 pounds so now we have access to 0.3 pound handheld touchscreen smartphones. We'll get more to that later. 